what's up guys this is uh, another video from Shafting TV so today I'm going to show you guys uh, how to add uh, YouTube subscribe pop-up buttons it's a uh, very simple so today I'm going to use Filmora Filmora is a video editing software it's very beginner and very basic and very self-explanatory uh, film uh, and video editing uh, software so if you are into YouTube you should definitely get your hands on Filmora. So Filmora is just, uh, you can get it in trial version as well. Also, they also run a deal for $55 a year, if I'm not sure. I think, yeah, $55 uh, for a lifetime and $30 or $40 for, for a year subscription. I mean, it's, it's really worth it, you know, because uh, you can edit a lot of videos and there's so many effects and transitions that you can apply to your videos you can make your videos look really cool so for today's video we are focusing on how to add uh, YouTube uh, pop-up subscribe buttons so this is my uh, user interface this is how the software looks so to this I'm going to uh, import my green screen file so for you guys I leave the download link for this green screen uh, video on the description uh, below so this is the uh, video that I'm going to uh, work on this is a green screen file I'll show you guys how it looks so I'm going to import this to the timeline and then play so this is just a green screen so we're going to edit this green screen to uh, customize the YouTube channel or you can customize it the way you want it uh, first thing I'm going to do is go ahead to titles and I'm going to choose uh, the titles, any titles that I like. I'm going to choose title number 33 and then I'm going to edit the title. I'm going to say welcome and I'm going to change the font style. I'm going to change the font style to this. And also, you need to change the color to any other colors except white. So I'm going to choose black and make it resize the text and then try to fit it here. So you fit it here. And then, next thing you want to do is get your YouTube uh, channel logo. So I'm going to get my logo to the screen. So I'll just go to import import media files and then I'm going to get my channel logo and then I'll click add it's going to come straight here you need to put it right on top of the timeline and then adjust it make it look very neat everything has to be on one one same line so you just double click the picture and then we are going to resize the image to a very small image to the size where we can fit into this corner. So we put in the text, also we fit in the YouTube logo as well here. And then what you need to do here is click on the uh, title and you need to go and say no animation to the text yeah and then okay so when you play this is how it should look there's still animations on the on the text we don't want any animations so so this is how it looks so simple as that we've completed the green screen we put in the text we put in the logo and you go to do what you're going to do now is we're going to import we're going to export the video file you say my button and then we are going to export it so the software is creating the video file and then it's done now I'm going to show you how to use that video file so I'm going to create a new project 
and then I'm going to import a media file. I'm going to import this video. This is one of my travel video. So I'm gonna, what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you guys how. So I took my video onto my media pad, and I'm going to add it to the timeline, and then. I'm going to go again import media files and then find the video I've just created. This is the video I've created, my button. So you open, get it to the software, add it to the timeline. It should go here, goes to the end of your video. Just take it on top of the video and keep dragging. And just put it here. Now, Let me take the video to the beginning of the video file. Simple as that. So whatever you've recorded, bring it to the import it to the software and then import the green screen edit that you've done. And then we are going to work the magic. Trying to get it. I'm trying to get the file. Okay. All you gotta do now is right click, click the green screen, and then this has to be enabled chroma key, and this has to be green color, and hit OK button. And once you start playing it, did you see that? Did you see that? So you can place this wherever you like. It's simple as that. So, but I'm going to animate this file. I want it to pop up to the middle of the video file. So I'm just going to double click on this and then go to motions and then we want up, down. So up, down, two. Just double click. Okay. Now when you play it, you'll see that it's going to come from the bottom of the video and then it's going to work out the magic. So simple as that guys. Hope you guys uh, enjoy the video and do, uh, do, do try and download Filmora. I'll also leave the Filmora link on the description uh, box below. And also the description box below, you will find the download link for the uh, green screen file. If you have any questions, guys, please do leave the comments, uh, questions on the, on the comment section below. I'll try to help you guys out. All right. Not a problem. And uh, hope you guys are having a good day. Enjoy your day and love you all. Thanks for watching my video. Please do subscribe and uh, stay busy uh, editing videos.